All right, folks, doing a BIOS overview. This is uh, MSI Mag Tomahawk B660. And uh, I just got to walk over to the other computer here. I'm using a wireless mic. Hopefully the audio comes out good. Um, so, yeah, I just got this. Uh, you know, it's had multiple things effed up with it. The socket pins damaged which probably led to the uh, two RAM slots that are bad in it. So we cannot do uh, dual channel. But, uh, you know, this BIOS overview, you'll uh, you'll get an idea of everything it has. So uh, you come in here first, and uh, basically we're seeing kind of like easy mode here. So if we check out what's up here at the top you can see today's date is wrong and the time's wrong cpu speed ram speed and this will uh enable xmp now i don't know if my ram is compatible but that is the spot that you would uh change it to get it on uh over here We've got our CPU core temp. So this is an i3-1200F with the stock cooler. Motherboard temp, core voltage, all this good stuff. And here is the BIOS version, September 6, 2022. So um, I will do a BIOS update video. We'll show you guys that. So this is giving information about the CPU over here. We click on that, we get memory, and you can see which uh, slots I'm in, B1, B2. Normally, you'd be A2, B2, but these are completely effed up. So you get what you get, right? But you guys at home should, uh, if you have one pair of RAM, should be an A2 and B2. All right, storage. I don't have any drives on here, so but that's if you did, you should see them in there. Fan info, of course you can uh, just your old fan curve. And this allows you to see the different fans. Over here, uh, if you were gonna do a BIOS update, check my video out. This is where you might go to do that. Hardware monitor. You can basically step through all these different things. CPU. CPU stock it, system, MOS, PCH. Let's see what else we want to look at here, folks. Um, favorites. I don't really screw with the favorites. There's none in here you can see. Uh, you would be able to add favorites. So let's jump over to advanced mode. Oh, one last thing, boot priority. If you had multiple drives in here, you would be able to uh, move them around and put your drive that has an operating system on it first or uh, potentially if you were trying to install Windows through a USB, uh, you'd wanna drag that to the top or uh, all the way to the left. So let's jump over to advanced mode. One thing that you can do here that I didn't note is uh, take a photo, F12, of uh, the actual screen. That can be helpful. All right, so jumping over to advanced mode. Settings. We're just going to go scroll through these. Some of the information about the motherboard. And jump in advanced. So a lot of stuff in here, folks. Um, instead of making this a 20 minute video or an hour video, we're just gonna pop these open. Now, if I see a, a sub menu that's looks worth checking out, I'll open those, but boot option. 
Once again, we don't have any drives, but you would see your drives there. Security, trusted computing, chassis intrusion, and you could save an exit right here if you wanted to. Let's go over to overclock. So this is a uh, locked motherboard, so not going to get a whole lot of, out of OC over here. Let's click on advanced. Some things you can do in here. Disable turbo boost if you wanted to. You can set your power limits. This is one place where MSI is, is better than the other motherboards. Just being able to come in here and do all this stuff and, and this nice little package that they've got set up here. Advanced RAM configuration. So you can see your timings. We'll just scroll through. This is a long menu. Getting carpal tunnel just from doing this, folks. Um, almost to the end. All right. Back to OC. And... We'll jump on this one. That's what's in that menu. CPU specifications, technology support. A lot of this, a lot of these menus, you guys are not even going to think about changing anything. CPU features. And is that going to do it, folks? Yeah. That's all there is to it, folks. I don't think I missed anything. Thanks for checking out the video. Um, please like, please subscribe. Thank you. As I walk all the way back over to my other computer.